All right. Now it's time to have a look at our feet. Now that you're lying on your back with a roller supporting your sacrum, we're going to start with toe curls. So we're going to pretend that we're making a catcher's mitt out of the back of our foot. And we're going to curl our toes, curl, 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 big toe curl, until all the knuckles are just fisted out like a knuckle sandwich. I'm going to get each one of those knuckles to pop out like you're making a fist. Okay. Now you might get some cramps and that's okay. Next, we're going to keep that position and we're going to do circles, small circles. We're not going to go extreme, extreme. We're going to keep it inside a small radius, supination, dorsiflexion, slight pronation, plantar flexion with a big stretch on the outside that stretches it back again. So as you learn to control the range of motion of your ankle while using all of the muscles of the, well, all the flexor muscles in the foot, um, the quadratus plantar muscle, the flexor of the digits that make that curl happen are also going to help you stabilize that ankle so that it doesn't get wild and crazy. So it's not this kind of thing. It's a very controlled, very controlled circle. Okay. When you get really good at that, you can write the alphabet in cursive. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, etc. H, I, J, K, <laughs> and just just play with it. L. Yeah. Take little breaks. Stretch them out. Try to spread your toes as wide as you can. Spread them out and curl. And by curl, I mean use the bridge. So stretch and bridge and curl. Open and bridge. Make a nice bridge and then take it into a curl. And open and spread. And bridge it out. So my right foot does the bridge part really well. It spreads out through the midfoot, and there's a, a lift through the, the longitudinal arch as well as the transverse arch, so you can see it from the side. It's lifting up. Left side, come on. Bridge, bridge. Oh, you can do it. So you might have some things happen with your big toe while you're trying to get that bridge. There we go. Bridge across the transverse arch. It'll get it. Teach one foot is going to be better, it's going to teach the other foot. Okay, so you start to get tired, drop them down, get some blood flow, and uh, take a bow. And last but not least, we're going to um, quickly show you where on the foot to massage. So in order to get the best activation of the transverse arch of the foot, which is sort of the bridging part, um, you can see there on the right side is doing a little bit better. There you go, left side. Um, what's going to help stimulate that area to, to really bridge well in that shape is a muscle on the bottom side of the foot um, called the uh, quadratus plantar muscle. And it, it is a square muscle here that makes up the base of a fan-shaped group of muscles, the um, 
flexor digitorum muscles, which digit means toes, so the muscles that go out to the toes form a fan shape, and then they come together in an attachment area that's like a square like that. And um, the lateral edge, or the toward the outer edge of the foot, is really where that muscle perks up the most when you stimulate that area. So rather than dig in here um, toward the inside arch of the foot, I'd like for you to work, you know, work all of this whole area, but end up with some cross fiber stimulation in that little area. I'll, I'll show you on the other foot. So again, you can see the muscles that flare out the toes, like a fan, are going to engage make a little pocket as it comes down and then it's going to attach at right where the heel comes together with the, with the rest of the foot. So this point is really significant in waking up that contraction. So as I push here, I get that, I get that pocket deepening um, here the transverse arches of the foot. Okay, so I'm going to go cross fiber. And then turn the foot over and it's easier to engage the transverse arch of the foot. Here's this is the longitudinal arch and this area here would be the transverse arch, cross bridge of the foot. So that actually feels a lot easier after stimulating it. It'll just get stronger and stronger. All right. Happy toe curling.